My name is Dr. Kathy Del Giorno. I'm an assistant professor at Vanderbilt University in the Department of Cell and Developmental Biology. The focus of our research is diseases of the pancreas, including pancreatitis and pancreatic cancer. Our laboratory combines small cell number RNA sequencing approaches with high resolution ultramicroscopy and animal models to understand early changes in the pancreas in response to injury and tumor genesis. In my field, I'm best known for my studies on how ASNR cells in the pancreas, which normally secrete digestive enzymes, change throughout the course of tumor genesis, including the formation of differentiated cell types such as tough cells, which is a way that the pancreas inhibits disease progression. Basic science is critical to our field of study because pancreatic cancer is diagnosed late, and this results in a terrible five-year survival rate that is now only 10%. We don't understand early changes in the pancreas and how these contribute to disease. So the point of our studies is to uncover these early changes and to translate them to diagnostics and early intervention strategies. My philosophy in running a lab is identifying the goals and the passions of the trainees in our laboratory and combining that with our goal of understanding pancreatic diseases. Funding is absolutely critical for our research because it allows us to bring more people into the field and to use the latest technologies to approach these problems. The outlook for pancreatic cancer and the treatment of pancreatic cancer patients is bright. Back in 2008, the five-year survival rate was only 5%, and now it's 10%, so it's doubled in the last several decades. But 10% is still one of the poorest five-year survival rates for any cancer. So there's a dire need for more research and better therapeutics. The outlook is bright because there is an increasing rate for five-year survival. More researchers are coming into this field and we're now employing better and newer techniques to undergo research and develop drugs.